Hi guys, this is just a quick video to show you uh, my latest drop of painting that I've done. These are house tiles from Victrix Limited. Just got these back. Um, they've taken some photographs for their website, so I thought I'd give you a quick little spin round so that you can have a look at them as well. Nice figures, once again, um, lovely shield transfers, as always, from Victrix, supplied by Little Big Man Studios. A joy to paint. They are a joy to paint. And you can weather them up a bit, like you can see I've done here. A few little shades of ink. Slap it on there. Make them look a bit more beaten up than what they actually are. Matte varnish them. And they look nice. This was the first house cold that I did. Thought I'd play about and try and sort of give some of them leather helms. He came out okay. Quite pleased with him. Um... And then after that it was this one, this was number two, this was second one, quite happy with the leather work, played about with uh, some blonde hair, which I've been trying to sort of perfect and, and get right, not brilliant but not terrible, once again enjoyed the leather work, shield transfer, easy to put on. Which is just the way that I like it. I don't want to spend ages freehand painting shields. I can do it, but I'll be honest. I like painting the figures, not the shields. Um, this was number three. This one here. Quite happy with him. Face turned out nice. Leather work turned out really nice. Uh, padded armour. Enjoyed painting that. I usually don't like painting that because... I have to mix up my own shades to get that padded armour effect, the linen effect, but I found a couple of paints that actually do that for me, so I don't have to mess about trying to get sort of individual pad padded armour. Like I say, leather work came out nice, quite pleased with that, combination of washes um, and base coating, sometimes it's a bit hit and miss, but yeah. That turned out quite nice. Same with the wood. Wood on the shields turns out quite nice. That's quite easy to do, to be honest. I might do a tutorial on that at some point. Just to show you guys how easy it is to do it. Yep, he came out right. And this was number four. Nice and easy to do the face because the helmet is actually separate. So I painted the face first. Let's put it up there so you can have a look. Yeah, painted face first. Stuck the helmet on. F fits on quite nicely, quite easily. You get a choice of helmets from Victrix. As as well, you get a choice of whether you want them to have two-handed axes or two-handed spear. I preferred the axes, to be honest, because uh, well, it was just my personal preference. Come on, get into view. God, I hate using my phone sometimes. Just about make out the wood effect that I got there on the shield. Leather once again. Yeah, so overall, pretty chuffed. I enjoyed it. Um, like I said, I've got these back from Victrix. They've taken photographs of these for their website. And yeah quite nice indeed anyway um stay tuned as it were because the ones in the background are the ones that i'm working on at the moment and i'll do another short video of those shortly but uh thanks for looking leave any comments if you fancy it'd be nice to hear that people liked them or disliked them but yeah thanks for looking see you soon